Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion, and this is Rim World. Well, we set out to go free a prisoner. We have two more prisoner uh, rescue opportunities around the map, which is pretty wild. They're just popping up all over the place. I'm not sure why the game wants me to have more folks, but it's fine. If I remember correctly, we also took a prisoner uh, who was actually better than the prisoner that we rescued in terms of their skills and passions. Semi in here uh, has recently had her resistance reduced. So resistance remaining is zero and it's a 42% recruitment chance. It's pretty good, I'd say. Uh, there's a bunch of boars over here since I found out recently that they are no longer capable of hauling things around the map. Um, we'll get rid of them. Yeah, they're not pack animals either, so wild boars are only useful for meat in my mind. I guess they are pretty decent fighters. They have a good amount of health and uh, their tusks do quite a bit of damage. So there is that. These guys are returning, if I remember correctly. Oh yeah. It still says that they're gonna be about five days. I don't think that's quite right. They should be faster once Pearson is able to walk. However, Lilith does have an infection. Oh no. Man hunting rats? It's been a long time since I've seen a dromedary. I'm trying to think of the last... It's just two of them, really? And we've had the best ambushes lately. Really just nothing to worry about for the most part. Let's move a little. There we go. That sniper rifle on a, on a rat though. Okay. We'll eat those two. I'm just kidding. Or am I? See if there's anything laying around that I didn't notice. Dead rats. Yeah, we'll take them, why not? Why not? We can only carry one, hilariously. They're too heavy. Yep. Keep on going. It says three days, but like I say, um, he should be walking at some point. He's got a wake-up addiction, so he'll, he'll probably still be in the prison while he's getting over that. Uh, but the torso, yeah, low consciousness. Did we grab any wake up whenever we took them out? No, it's fine. Uh, Lilith has an infection is what I was trying to say in her leg. So that's slowing them down a little bit as well. She should be fine. Yeah. She is fine. Yeah, it doesn't slow him down by much, though. He's the one that's uh, really giving him the business. It'll be fine. They've still got a day and a half worth of food. It'll be fine. Surely. I have a bunch of plants marked to be taken down, but for some reason no one's getting around to them. Growing, plant cutting. What else is there? Cooking and construction. I don't have anything queued up. Well, yeah, I do. All of this over here, but most of that is wood also. So until we get the trees cut down, we can't do any work on these. Psychic drone is ending. That's wonderful. Yeah. 
If it looks like they are going to be a long way away, um, yeah, Pearson's no longer incapable of walking, so now it's down to three days. I might have to take them some, uh, some food. Maybe down to two days. I don't know, though. I, I still think they'll make it. One day worth of food. Another bandit camp. Orbital power beam targeter. I love those things. And a healer mech serum. It's only five enemies. We're definitely doing this one. Those are amazing uh, rewards. It's a little further out than uh, any of the others that we've done so far. But it should be fine. Oh, maybe I should. I probably ought to take them uh, some food. Let's see. Yeah, this will be fine. I'll give... I'll have Semi make the first delivery. This will be her initiation. And they'll bring they'll bring some of it back, I'm sure. Uh, and then I want you to take a gun with you. So that you don't die. A shotgun. Or... Yeah, we don't have any more auto pistols. The range on these is just... It's not that bad, I guess. And the high rate of fire, I think, is reasonable. Okay. Meet up with these guys. Go for it. Oops. I was already had it selected. Take all the food. Yep, she's healthy. She has a lot of good skills. She is a slowpoke, though, which is a bit of a shame. It's fine. Got this poor corpse just hanging out down here. That'll also be fine. So it's not even going to take her a day to get there. That's what I was hoping for, because they're walking towards each other. They should meet up no problem. There's a stealth aspect to this, if I'm not mistaken. Movement speed, visibility, 20% here. Visibility, 100%. So it's how easy the caravan is to notice. Yeah. And so it is the size of the caravan, not the uh, other stuff. Oh, no. Now it looks like they're sleeping. That's not what I wanted to happen. It's fine. They'll just meet up in the morning then. Yeah, huh. Still no plants being cut. It's really strange to me. Because I definitely need wood. This could probably be deconstructed though. I wouldn't mind leaving this here, uh, just because that cooler is feeding in heat to this room. I wanted it to be saved, and um, yeah, I kind of enclosed this afterwards once I found out that these things uh, deteriorate if they're outdoors, technically, even if they're roofed. Didn't always used to be like that back in my day. Yeah, it was definitely different, though. Yeah. Oh. I think they... Yeah, they've passed each other already. Hilarious. Okay, you guys merged then. And now you've got two days worth of food. That doesn't seem right. I feel like there were a lot of meals there. But I guess there's a lot of people here, too. Six of them. Roto is not a fantastic character, but we'll take him anyway. He's uh, primarily a miner. He does have a shooting skill, though, which is pretty fantastic. Why is this medicine un unforbidden? I'd like to know. Maddie, where did you go to get those potatoes? 
I'd like to note. That seemed like he was going a long way. Cooking. Oh, I never changed this over to cotton? That's hilarious. Oh, man. No wonder they haven't been cutting down trees. They were planting that huge field up here in potatoes and harvesting them. That's madness. Absolute madness. Sorry if you're hearing a low rumble right now. Airplanes. It does happen. Group from Rabbitant. Husband of Semi. Well, she's not here right now. Town Councilman Viking? I guess his name is Viking. You're her husband, he said? That's crazy. I think they'll be here soon. 1.1 days. It seems like after I brought them food, they, uh... Yeah, they're still taking a long time. They're not healing up like I'd hoped they would. Lilith is actually fine now. She's gotten over her infection. She's got a scratch scar and a burn scar on the eye. Why are you incapacitated again? Oh, withdrawals. Yeah. Get out of here, you guys. There isn't anybody here who needs to talk to you. I tell ya. Soothe for the females. That's fine. Emmy and... Oh. Nope, Semi is out on a run, so it's just her. That's a lot of potatoes. That's really good, though. I'm actually not even mad that we have all those potatoes laying around. Okay, control. how about you help out a little bit here? Go ahead and haul these in. That's a lot of potatoes, for real. That's going to take him all day, I think, just running back and forth. It's fine. It needs to be done. You know what else needs to be done? Bye, Ben. I need you to start cutting trees, please. So we seriously need wood. What in the world? Immobile caravan? Pearson died from chemical damage? That's crazy. I never heard about that before. Uh, oh, they're carrying too much now. That's why they're immobile. Uh, the dead rat can go. Yes, abandon the dead rat. We don't need the clothes, the tattered clothes. Tainted, whatever. Still only at 280. drop one of these bids. That's definitely not something that we need to carry. It's 50 kilograms. Just drink these beers. Drink the beers. We'll be fine. I guess they want to carry them all the way home and uh... Yeah. Alright. Now get in here. Are they still immobile? No, 0.2 days. Okay. Pearson was slowing us down anyway. He was a good character, though. So I am sad about it. Since we're not going to have the materials for this all the time, Psychoid leaves. Uh, I think I will go ahead and throw this in here. 
Let's see. Let's try this right quick. Copy. And then, not the potatoes. Paste. There we go. So it doesn't put it exactly... Um, exactly where it is in the other... Oh, I never equipped that gun uh, for semi. That's a bit of an oversight. Would have been tragic if she had been attacked. Okay, semi. Uh, go ahead and equip it. And then Hiroto, you have a shooting skill? Yes. Um, this revolver? I thought we brought back some auto pistols. I could be wrong. I should have armed him whenever we were uh, out and about as well. Sorry we don't have room for you right now. It's mostly because my folks are selfish jerks. And they don't actually get out and build like they're supposed to. And cut down trees for the wood that we need to construct things. Hopefully now though it will get done. Still a bunch of potatoes over here. But the stockpile is just about full. I'm really thinking about uh, just deconstructing this stuff and use that as extra stockpile space. There's no reason not to. It's not going to collapse the roof or anything. This should be deconstructed as well. We need to assign work for semi. Uh, we'll try to get her cooking skill up. Hopefully it won't take up all of her time. But also we only have two uh, stoves. Hunting she can work on also. Yeah, they're both miners. That's kind of funny. group of mechanoids. Here they are. I think this is our first group that we faced of them. It looks like four of them. Uh, who is my good fighter? Let's see. Everybody needs to be in the safety zone. Uh, let's see. Emmy and Maddie. You guys are stuck inside. This needs to be turned on. Bye, Ben. Go ahead and flick that switch here. Uh, yeah. Man. A mace really just is not a good idea here. Got a 13, 7. You have a good gun, though. Maddie, you don't fight. 14, you've got a good gun. 5. 7. And an 8. Grief. You're even close to him. Just grab these EMP grenades for me. Okay, what are we looking at here? Oh, no. Oh, no, it's a little more than four. It's four uh, Scythers and three Lancers. So previously, the Scythers had charged lances and uh, knife hands. Now, they've separated them up into knife hands and lancers separately. Separated them up separately. You know how it goes. Okay, uh, we're in a bad way then. That's a lot of enemies. Let's get everybody drafted up. And in here... That's not bad. Um... This isn't roofed, is it? No. It should be. And this should also be roofed right here. We'll work on that uh, after this. Assuming we survive. Why isn't this connected? Yeah, it should be close enough. And we have power. So that should... Refresh. There we go. C 
could put this in here. It'll blow open this room, which is a little unfortunate. This will set fire to the crops. So it might be better just not worrying about that. Uh, okay. Grief, you're gonna need to be up close, that's for sure. Lee. That's not a bad spot. Um, let's get everybody backed up a little bit, though, so I can get them actually arranged the way that I would like for them to be. Okay, Grief. I don't think you're faster than them, so I think they're going to be into shooting range before you could get across here. But those scythers are going to be coming straight in, so I want you to be up front. Uh, Lee, I would like for you to also be up front. Go right here, please. Um, let's see. Semi, you have a close range weapon. It's difficult to say where to put a lot of these people. They're not going to have cover by standing behind each other either, which is a bit of a shame. Cantrell, Lilith. Lee, you could actually post up right here. Stinch, up here. Hiroto, right there. Iban, you're hanging behind until we uh, desperately need you. Yeah, these Lancers are going to be a problem because they have a huge range advantage over us. And we absolutely can't do anything about it. Uh, Charge Lance. I don't think... I don't know if they do massive uh, melee damage. I might send Viban after a Lancer. Anytime, Grief. Anytime, buddy. That was too far out there. It's okay, though. It got one of them. Grief, you're gonna have to pull back. Bye, Ben. Uh, go after them. What are you talking about? A siege? Nice. Oh, we stunned our own turret. Lee is down. What do you mean, a siege? Are you kidding me right now? Okay, stench. I need you to focus here. Semi also. Kendrill, you can help out up here. I need to take this thing down as fast as possible. Nice. Uh, Lilith, put the sniper rifle, please. Uh, Byban's shield has failed now. Uh, run back here if you can make it. Hilarious. Okay, uh, he's taking damage though. He just gets bruised from the lances. I just need his shield to charge up and then we'll be fine. Uh, you guys though, we need you all to rush in. Grief. Try to get close enough to throw your grenade. Stinch. Yeah. Semi behind the tree. Hiroto behind the tree. It's kind of in the line of fire of Lilith, but hopefully she will be safe here. Run by Ben. Oh no, I was worried about that. Yeah, now none of us have cover as we rush at him. Hiroto, buddy. I need you to live. I need Bybe to live also. There we go. Got one. Nice. Nice. Oh, we handled that way better than I was expecting to. Okay. Uh, let's see. Everybody, get the undraft. Grief, what are you doing, buddy? Rescue Byban. Perfect. Uh. Who's... Is anybody grabbing Lee? Go ahead and rescue Lee. Okay. Uh, so previously we could remove the blades. It doesn't look to be a thing anymore. Which is okay. 
We'll deal with it. Stench. Come on now. How badly did you get injured? You're pretty horribly injured, as a matter of fact. What happened? Oh, he got blown up by the turret. He was standing right next to it, got blown up. Oh, that's right, they automatically rebuild. Kuroto. That's right, get those smoke leaves inside. Then you could probably heal yourself. Can you? Can you heal yourself? No. That's annoying. Oh man, that was brutal. And now we've got a siege preparing in our backstages here. They've got the blueprint down. What are we looking like for range? We've got this guy with the bolt action. Pump shotgun, machine pistol, revolver. Okay, so the bolt action is our worst enemy here. There's two of them. I think with Lilith we could approach well, even coming up back here, it would be dangerous, but we could come up back here and shoot at them uh, from that angle. Let's try to get a little bit patched up uh, from this, though, first. Man. It's incredibly brutal. A stench is shredded up. He's about to die, so we need to get him tended to soon. Uh, can we please get another stockpile of medicine here? And I want to switch this over to... Yeah, this is uncritical already. Um, it's not going to let me haul it, though. Is it merging? Okay. Which means I would have to... Okay, so these, can I not uh, merge stockpiles? Am I gonna have to delete this one and then build it? That's annoying. Okay, so this has to be two stockpiles then, right? Yeah, dumb. It's fine though. Okay. I think it is manufactured, isn't it? Medicine. Let's just remove that. And then we'll copy and paste. And, uh, Maddie, I want you to take a stack. Not the... Oh, that was Maddie. I was right-clicking on that like a madman, and it finally finally let me do that. He's only got four hours to live. Three hours now. Uh, Stench, how about you come in here and rest, buddy? So that somebody takes care of you. Grief is taking care of Byben. Is he even going to make it to the bed? Yeah, he will. Uh, my next best doctor is Grief. He's taking care of Byben. Who has five hours to live only. We had eight hours. Ten. Wow. They built that fast. Here it is. Good grief. Yeah, and of course they're using incendiary shells. Because we have a wooden base. This is not good. Get the animals out. Let's unrestrict these two. Hopefully they'll take care of uh, fires when it comes up. Three hours, ten hours, eight hours. Semi has some experience. Maddie's on fire right now. He's not very good either. Cantrell. Cantrell was right here, wasn't he? He's right next to the medicine. Go ahead and tend to stench here. Yeah, this is not good. 
Okay, I think we're saving this one for the next episode, though. So if you want to catch that one, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. I thank you so much for all the time you spend on my channel. And I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.